Hey, this is Glendon, and I was going to do this a little differently, but this is my why is Gumroad better than PayPal for selling digital products and even some physical goods? There's a lot of, uh, I'm doing the $1 challenge, you know, part of this course that I'm taking. So if you want to support me, please, you know, I want you to support me, please do. Just uh, check that out on the previous video. And this, I'm doing this reason because someone, good guy, um, it's just like, you know, I've never heard of Gumroad and I'm more comfortable paying with PayPal. I buy a lot of stuff online and I don't have a PayPal account. I use my credit cards. This, this, PayPal's done an excellent job at convincing y'all that for some reason that if you don't use them that your life will end. Some dragon is going to come from the nether regions of Beelzebub and just stroke your ass down. It's not going to happen. Hey, be sure to support me on my $1 challenge. And also, be sure to get your free audiobook, The Hustler's Mindset, Pimping Your Mind for Success. This is how you protect yourself before I get into a review. Monitor your online credit card statements once a week. Anything happens, do a chargeback, you're good. It's not going to cost you any money. It's not even going to really cost you a lot of time. It's just being responsible. Now, let's get to my... I've had gun roads since July. So this will be a six-month review. When I first started, there was a little learning curve, but it was very, very short because Gumroad is very intuitive. Now, if you're going to use Gumroad, this is what it's good for. <coughs> Excuse me. It's good for selling digital products, which could be ebooks, audiobooks, movies, anything that's digital. And you can use it to sell physical products if you so desire. I use it only to sell digital products or consulting services. Now, this is why it kicks PayPal in the ass. With Gumroad, you can take your digital product and upload it to their site for free. People are like, they take 5%. Okay, Gumroad gives you the option of creating a landing splash page, whatever. You just put a link, have someone go to Gumroad, they check out. It's very seamless. If you've done any research, the longer people have to kind of dicker around with checking out, there's something called shopping cart abandonment rate, where people have goods in the shopping cart, but because it's taking too long, they say, deuces, I'm out of here. So that's very, very important if you're selling anything online that your customer can check out as fast as possible. Gumroad facilitates that with steroids. Also, another reason that Gumroad is better than PayPal, in my opinion, it is hassle-free, it's easy to use, you contact people, you get real answers versus blah, 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 blah. And this is for me, you know, I sell digital products. It's awesome, six months of experience. <clears throat> uh, six months of experience. I've not had one issue, one, issue, uh, one glitch, there was one product that I uploaded and somehow it didn't really format and I had to re-upload it. They sent me an email and it was solved. You get paid every two weeks. It's freaking awesome. It is totally, totally awesome. Also, Gumroad allows you to stream video. So you can put up this huge, and they give you five freaking gigabytes to put up a product. So what you can do is put up an audio. You can do a Beyonce. You can put together your videos and everything in a bundle. People buy it and they download it or they stream it. And then, you know, what I would say for something, an extremely large file, it would be better to have them stream it because, you know, Five gigs going to an iPad or a phone is going to take up a lot of storage. So, you know, do the streaming. But it's just definitely a much better platform. I love it. I recommend it. Now, some reasons not to use Gumroad. If you're going to try to sell physical products, understand there's this two week delay in getting paid. So, if you need your money really quickly, Gumroad is not the place for you. If you can wait two weeks, yeah. And you can put the shipping. Uh, another reason that, you know, actually, that's kind of that's kind of the only reason not to use gun bro. Unless, you know, that 5% is going to just, just, just totally put you in the negative. Now, this is something else that's really great about gun bro. When someone buys something from you, you have what's called your customer base. And they've had it set up that if you have a new offering or something, you can just send an email to everyone that bought something from you through that list. That is priceless. That is totally, totally priceless. So if you never heard of Gumroad, check it out. If you're selling digital products, 
if you're selling books, ebooks, audiobooks, any type of books, it is great and it will help you with the checkout because the thing is, I ran an experiment using Gumroad for six months because if you notice, the Hustlers Food, the blog just came back. I didn't have a blog. Um, there was Storage Auction Shogun. I wasn't directing people there. I was making sales using YouTube and Facebook. I had no website that I was making sales from. Let me say that again. I was making sales from YouTube and Facebook. I had no website. That is the power of the disruptive economy. You can actually make a living without a website. The reason that I pulled the Hustlers Food in is because I wanted to do the blog. I wanted to write about it. But the thing is, it's not necessary. It's absolutely not necessary. And a lot of people don't understand that. It's just how you're positioned on the Internet. Because I have this YouTube channel and it's going on five years old. This channel gets more traffic than more blo most blogs. I can honestly say that because I've checked the ranks. Most blogs don't even get half, no, they don't even get 25% of the traffic that this channel gets. So in a way, this channel is kind of like my vlog, blog, website, all of that because in the digital disruptive economy, it's all about getting hits. I don't care how beautiful your website is, if you only get 20 people a day that come there, your chances of you doing really well financially are slim to none. You need to get traffic to whatever you have, whether it's a product on eBay, if it's a product on Amazon, if you need traffic, you need people to be able to find you, take what you have and get it as simply as possible. That's the beauty of Gumroad. And, you know, let's just have the PayPal conversation because there are many new people to the G-verse. I had some serious issues with PayPal going on seven, eight, nine years ago. And I haven't used them since. One time, they held 32 grand of my money. The second time, they held 18,000. Fuck PayPal. Okay? I'm not using them. For, screw it. And if you, that's, you know, like I said, if you drunk the Kool Aid of their marketing thing and feel that, you know, if you don't use them, like I said, the dragon from Beelzebub's gonna just swoop down and take your ass, then that's you. And don't buy my products because I'm not using it. I have one merchant account where you can use PayPal if you so desire, but fuck PayPal. And I don't really think I'm losing out a lot because, <laughs> I mean, seriously, if you're worried about losing a dollar and that something's going to happen to you really bad, and I'll, I'll talk, I'll, actually, I'll even go a little further on that because everyone knows this thing that happened with Target, right? And all these credit card numbers were compromised. I go to Target all the time. And when I saw the announcement, I didn't lose a wink. No, not, not even a wink. I didn't lose a wank. W A N K. I didn't lose a wank of sleep. I know I checked my statements. And the there was two credit cards that I used there because I don't use debit cards to shop. Do not use debit cards to shop. Just pay your credit card off every week. And everyone's like, no, you can yes, you can. I've done it for years. You can pay your credit card every week. They will also raise your limit. Trust me on this. So just pay you, you know, just use your credit card like you use your debit card. And just use your debit card to get cash. You just have way more protection. And there was two cards I used at Target during the time they got this. And both the credit card companies sent me an email saying, hey, we're going to issue a new card. Check my statements. I haven't been compromised. Nothing's happened. It ain't that hard, people. Take accountability of your financial life. It ain't that hard. You should be checking your credit card statements. You shouldn't. It's, this ain't that big of a deal. But, you know, getting back to Gumroad, I, I fully endorse it. I recommend it. I'm actually going to do a course at some point in Hustler University on how to really use it. Because the thing is, it's really product and driven. Because the thing is, what I'm doing with my ebook course right now, and it's really funny. The beginning starts as the same as what I'm doing with resale courses. It's about marketplaces. It's about finding the appropriate marketplaces for your product versus creating a product and hope it sells. It's, it's, it's really interesting when you come up with something and you have to test and you have to make it, you have to fall down and you, you make mistakes. But when you hit, you hit well. So understand, Gumroad is great. Gumroad, to me, my personal opinion, they're not paying me. I fully endorse them. They're way better than PayPal. Way better, personal opinion, my experience. Six months of using them. 
no glitches, no errors, no problems. It's been very seamless for me. And it's been very seamless for most of the people who buy from me. And I have a lot of folks who have bought from me using Gumroad. So it ain't that big of an issue. So that's the deal. So just check it out. See what it's about. If you are selling, like for those of you who make beats, Gumroad is awesome for you. It's freaking awesome because there's so many things that you can do. All right, this is Glendon. I'll see you on the good side.